What's up? This is AC News here. So I got the latest edition for tomorrow, basically. I mean, it's August 14th. It's the 13th right now. They put this thing where you get free newspapers to McDonald's. Why I buy it? So that's just about the nursing program approved by the IBHE. So it's like a SAU, you know, some kind of, you know, approved programs, you know, three programs that are healthcare bachelor degree and registered in nursing and doctor eight programs in physical therapy so they're trying to get programs that will save money on the students but you know it's been really rough on us because the state is basically broke they were really, really planning to raise another 20 taxes on us or put 20 more basically so Air Force Veterans is like it's going to have Booker Men's KPR. You know, the Res the Resitum, um County Air Post Authority announced it will recommend Cape Air to the U.S. Department of Transportation for the air service at the v Veterans Airport in Southern Illinois. So basically, it's saying it's recommended, which I heard about it before they were opening it couple months ago so you know Walmart's got that posted a lot in the times when new things open so they got all these ads of course you know SIU medicine and all that and part of the announcement and so it's like all these donations you know and Carville's trying to get solar power right now. It seems like I, I just read it and it's like trying to get like 40% from a solar plant. That's like the northeast of Carville that they wanted to get money, I guess, for. Try to get cleaner energy. Because we're burning the planet up with fumes and it's not good for the environment. So basically, it's needed, I guess, but it's going to be really expensive. I got all these coupons, of course. This evening, which I can't even drive to, basically, because I don't have a license. I'm, maybe one day I will be able to. They find out what the disorder I, I have that would take me. I don't know enough to research for, um, for the health. So, yeah, all these tools that are on sale. Potato chips, you know. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I, I try to print coupons all the time, but uh, it uses ink. We used to have a place in the store where they do coupons. I guess they just put tired, but I mean, I can't blame them because the new servers have changed since then. They're smaller, they're thinner, they're not as much as coupons as before. It's not as much as before. They cut back a lot because um, not enough money. And we stopped getting newspapers because we weren't going to pay the PI price tag they have the mail delivered and have less value that's only about maybe like a couple of DVDs like one DVD couple DVD discs thick it's not very thick and I guess it's just not worth it you know save a lot we gotta save a lot in town so I can walk through that right now they got a weekly deal it seems like uh, this week only Three for, so of course it's 12 packs, three for 11. So yeah, seems like they got some bargains, I guess. I can honestly get some of these hand picks for like a dollar with the Walmart brand. And they're perfectly fine. You know? And I had to buy ketchup because I left it out Friday uh, evening on the chair. So it basically went bad. So I had to buy a whole entire new one. So they got hash brown patties for like four bucks almost. Pretty close, one cent off. Currently right now. So with my new medicine, my um, water pill, I ain't supposed to have a lot of potassium. That, uh, I figure that's already got in it. And some people with a certain, like, kidney disease, like my mom, it builds up. Everything lasts longer in her body because of the disease. And 
I got tested, I think it was a couple weeks ago. I'm still waiting for the hemophilia test to come back. That was a couple weeks ago as well. I mean, it was after a month after the, or so, or, or like three weeks after they had that testing done on me when I went to my doctor in Carmadale and um, had my liver and kidneys and sugar tested. Usually I get a packet in the mail about my health, you know, how, and usually the sugar is close to diabetes, where it's a little bit high, where they don't like it as much, you know, still okay, but not perfect, you know, and then the liver always shows up because of the hemophilia part of my liver, my disease, where the blood's in, and surprisingly, we called them, my mom called them, and called them, called them you know, the SIH, and the, all the labs, the vitals were completely normal. One of my prayers was answered, apparently, because my clotting activity has been really good, actually, in the last seven months or more. It hasn't been as bad. It's been really improved. I can definitely tell, because I knew my hemophilia all my life, how it actually works, how my body can, how good it really was, and how bad it really was, you know, in clotting activity. I'm going to tell you one thing right now. It wasn't as good as it is right now. It was really awful with that thing, blood, and it just wasn't worth it. I mean, it's it's a painful disease. It's really expensive. And I'm waiting for the hemophilia test to come back because I'm sure I don't have the disease because I've been healing every time. I mean, I the injury I did on my birthday would let me to the hospital easily because of the humongous weight on my feet. And they were hot, but they didn't swell up or anything. So, as well as the face, it swelled up a little bit, but it, it went away without any kind of medicine. Several times like that this year, after the first big, huge bleed, the first two ones. And that's after that, I think I did a prayer or two, or a couple. And one of them actually did work, and I haven't had a bleed like that since the first of the year. The first couple months. Or first month, I mean. So yeah, it's it's been a miracle, it's a game changer. So yeah, it it works. Believe in your Lord Jesus Christ, who apparently answered one of my prayers when I was fasting and took care of the disease. I'm praying no more long, long with me and more. I don't miss it because it's horrible. It was completely horrible. You know, your body, my body just never had that clotting system. I was like born with that one, basically. Cause I lack factor eight, so like every time I got cut or something, it took longer to heal. It would not basically clot unless I had a lot of pressure for like an hour or two. And um, surgeries would have to have factor every time. You know, work needed and no spray can't take any more because my body reacts severely to it. So yeah, the body's been working better. I can tell. I mean, everything's been clotting quickly. Actually, and even the nose has been improved. A lot over the months. Definitely the best it has been right now of the year. Barely even, maybe just like 50 seconds or less, 30 seconds. And it's already clotted by 50 seconds or so. So, yeah, it's been improving. You know, it's just, I was lucky enough. So, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe and comment like below. Thanks for watching. See ya.